some of the earliest settlers of the Yaoyoi period arrived in the Fukuoka area. The city rose to prominence during the Yamamoto period. Because of the cross-cultural exposure and the relatively great distance from the social and political centers of Kyoto, Osaka, and later Edo, Tokyo, Fukuoka gained a distinctive local culture and dialect that has persisted to the present. Good to know. I've been thinking, Isti, were you here before Planetin was founded? No, I was in a deep slumber. When Pluto became a CPU, I woke up. So when you first woke up, you were greeted by her? Yes, her. Hmm? What's going on? Ik Pluto. Um, well, we were talking about the time you first became a CPU. Me? Then you should have just asked. Yeah, I guess so. How'd the legend begin, Pluto? So, I went on a picnic and was eating my lunch by this really pretty river. And then this shiny thingy came floating downstream. Shiny, huh? The CPU memory, I assume. I picked it up, and while I was wondering what it was, I got super bright, and then Isti appeared. Ah, so CPU has finally been born in this land. Nice to meet you. I am Istuar. I have come to help... I have come here to aid you, CPU of Planetune. Oh, an adorable little girl just popped out. Hmm. Huh? I am Plutia. No, that name is hardly artistic. How about this? In this form, I will go by Iris Heart. What is with this person? I sense danger. No, it must be my imagination. She is a CPU, so it should be okay, surely? Oh, ignoring me and talking to yourself, are we? Such a naughty little one. Oh, pardon me. That was not my intention. I understand if that's how it is. I'll make it so you won't dare to take your eyes off me again. What? No! After that, Noir came looking for Plutia and met a very similar fate. Okay, you painted a very clear picture for me. He 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 he. Plutia, this isn't a story that you should blush over. Because such a thing happened, I was rather believed relieved when both you and Noir became CPUs. Whatever happens, you two must be able to stop Plutia when she... Sorry, but even with the two of you, that might be kind of hard. He 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 he. Again, Pluti, this isn't the type of story to blush and giggle over like that at all. Unbelievable, this monster. So when someone feels Plutia's wrath, they end up like that. Oh, I had that happen to me. Oh. Now then, let's find a way to cross Louise border. I'll give that CPU a piece of my mind. <laughs> I gave Noir some really good service. Yum, I'm so full. What did she do to her? <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to call it out on a bet here. I think this was forced cunnilingus. Yep, that's what I think it was. And it seems that Noir doesn't remember that time at all. Sucks, I'm kind of curious to know what Sadie did to her. Cats, cats, who had cats? Weird. So apparently Plutia is the type to help someone. Albeit she has nefarious reasons for doing so. Let's say here. Not let's see. Let's say. Okay, cool. What do we get? And now Noir has some really bad flashbacks whenever she sees her. Could you imagine if we get a cutscene where 
Ultra Noir wakes up and just talk, says Plutia and just starts panting and sweating. It's Keisha! Bastard! She's already in this game! Damn. Doesn't Noir talk to a cat in V2, if I recall correctly? Metallic? Oh, it's those Sony pets from 2003. Or was it a Tamagotchi? What? Oh, just actual cats. Okay. Noir feeds cats. Makes sense, she's always working. I don't know why, but I think that sounded really sexist, that I didn't mean for that to sound sexist. Hmm. Did Noir think that they would make fun of her for this? I, you know, I think Noir believed that Plutia would somehow take advantage of this. If so, he's got a really bad opinion of her friends. I acknowledge your assistance! <laughs> That's hella rude! あ、<笑><笑> That means it's a wild pet, Plutia, don't you know? That's usually what that means. I get that you're slow, but come on! This should be bare minimum. Come on, knowledge! Astray. Actually, assuming that she can open her eyes... Strays are capable of moving around by themselves. It'll take some time. I'm pretty sure they could survive. Wait, do we have to fight cats now? Oh, goodness me. We have to fight cats! That is not what the... Oh, wow. From I acknowledge your existence to I love you. Hmm. Interesting take. Yes. She's leaving you behind. This cutscene is still going! Unbelievable! Fruity named Pow? What kind of shit? 
Neprun? Neptune, Neptune, Noir is has to prepare to end up forever alone. Yep, that's the fate of Noir. 100%. She's too argumentative. I don't think anyone wants to come home to that. I guess some people in this fan base would, because they are that desperate. But I'm going to assume most of you watching are not that desperate. <laughs> I swear if you are. Gotta get a grip, okay? You must dedicate your time to self-improvement. Doing so, and you get your pick at the litter instead of chasing one down. Okay? Let this be a warning to all of you. Okay? Men, women, gay, straight. This is a warning to all of you. Think about it, and we have to fight a cat. <laughs> Damn. I thought I, w I was kidding! Oh wait, no, this isn't a cat. What the hell is this? It's a baby bug! <gasps> oh no! What poor little girl was turned into a CPU failure? Bastards. Never mind, we do so much damage anyways. Oh, we win. I thought that would be harder. They're probably all scared of us now because we just pwned the hell out of that one monster. Wait, did we beat up the mother cat? That's horrible if we did. Ellipses, why so glum? Sorry, let's head back. He looks so sad. Oh, okay. Catanese? The words of the cat, you understand it? My heart aches from its innocent reaction. Bye bye. Damn. さ、またせたわね。今度こそ帰りましょう。その時、ノワールの瞳に小さな雫が浮かんでいたことに私は気づかなかった。彼女がどれだけの決意で別れを口にしたのか、それはきっと why does this sound like the epilogue to a really bad anime from 1980s? <laughs> Sounds like a Sailor Moon epilogue. Not even. They wouldn't do that. Would they? No, I don't think so. It'd have to be a different one. Dream Hunter Rem? No. Can't be. That that show is too... Rated R. <laughs> rated M for... <clears throat> no. Rated R for adults, because that show is messed up. Okay, before we continue, let's get out of Planetoon, go to the last station for the events, and then before going to Louis, before going to Louis, we're getting a bunch of quest change done. Information. My goodness. Now then, shall we play some RPGs today, too? Inputting password. The revival spell is incorrect. Oh, I mistyped 0 and O. I can't distinguish some of this. That's what I wrote. But my magic is so messy. We're the only magazine who thinks seriously about games and doesn't mess around. 